welcome back to Wine Around the Corner. We're here, we talk about all things wine, red wine, white wine, sweet wines, and also dry wines. Y'all, I'm gonna make this real quick. <clears throat> this is gonna be a quick, a quick review. As y'all can see, I'm in my kitchen. Um, I got some chicken back here marinating. Um, and while I'm in the kitchen, I'm gonna be sipping on this um, wine here. It's called Masi by Modelo. And I just wanted to show y'all real quick. This is what I'll be drinking on. Today is Sunday. Happy Sunday to everybody. Uh, sorry, y'all, I haven't been posting. And I'm kind of doing this unconventional video because y'all, I've been having a lot going on these past few weeks. Um, I'll get into that a little bit later, but my life has been really, really hectic these last, since last month, the month before last, um, I had something tragic happen in my family and it was unexpected. So I had to take some time to woosa and regroup. So I'm still not a hundred percent. Um, probably won't be for a while, but I still wanted to bring you guys some videos. So today, you won't see me on camera. Um, this is kind of a, a video. I just wanted to, you know, bring something to y'all so I can show the love and let y'all know that I'm still here. I'm not going anywhere, but I, I had to take some time to myself for a while. So today we're going to be talking about, um, this wine by Modelo and it is called Mossy and it comes like this with this tag right here on the front and on the inside of the tag it just has um like kind of like a backstory of the wine right here i'm not going to go into detail but then it has this portrait on the other side here so um this is a 2015 edition of this wine it is a red wine and then on the back here um really doesn't i don't really see any notes on it it's 12 percent uh, volume of alcohol uh let's see here at the bottom like i said again it just kind of gives you a background of the wine but it doesn't have any notes on it so we'll be tasting this one real quick and i'll let you guys know what i think about it i've already opened it and poured me a glass so let's get into this tasting give me just a second okay so at first taste of this one it's a little bit on the drier side it's a little bit bitter it's not real real sweet um at all uh like i said again because most red wines depending on which one you get they're not it depends on which one you get depends on what kind of sweetness more fruit so this one doesn't taste like it has like any kind of spice or anything in it but i'm definitely getting um fruit with it um not so much a spice fruit but like a drier fruit i'm not sure if this may have plum or something in it that's kind of what i'm getting is a little bit of plum definitely probably a red grape blend um but like i said again it doesn't tell me exactly what fruit what the um it doesn't exactly tell me what this wine has in it so i'm not sure and then this is actually looks like it might be french or something i'm not sure what language that's in so we're not going to even try to go into that um yeah so i'm not sure i'd have to do a little bit more research on this wine and like i said again this is kind of a last minute um review for me for this one it's actually been sitting in my kitchen for probably about a week and a half now and i'm just now opening it so this is my first glass out of it um i'll have to do a little bit more research and then get back with y'all on exactly what this wine um is blended with but it overall um really quickly just overall it's a good wine um not bad at all it's not my favorite one it's not it's not a bad one it's not one of one that like i said again i'm gonna be totally honest with y'all 
this wine is not one that i would just go purchase pick up i mean the bottle is nice the packaging is real nice on it and it is affordable um i have the tag on the back i did peel it off because i was trying to get to the um to see you know what it had as far as notes but the wine itself oops but the wine itself was only 9.99 so ten dollars for a nice bottle uh 750 mils i believe um which is pretty much the standard for most wines overall is it good give it a try if you see it um it's like i said again it's not bad at all but you have to have a taste you have your palate has to have that taste to want this wine if that makes sense guys so give it a try pick it up um my husband actually purchased this one for me along with another bottle uh, which we'll do that review next weekend um that's gonna be something different that i've never done on my channel so i'm thinking y'all gonna be really excited about that one because that's gonna be my first time reviewing that particular kind of wine beverage so i'm excited to do that one for you guys next week but yeah give it a try this one again is called masi i believe i'm pronouncing it correctly um if you want to give me look up some notes on it if y'all have definitely comment in the bottom um if y'all can look up the notes tell me if y'all find anything on this wine as far as a flavor profile in it but overall it is a good wine try it you know taste it for yourself and it might be something that you actually you know want to keep in your collection if you're a wine connoisseur uh, if you have a you know wine cellar or you just collect different wines to have one hand for company or whatever this probably would be a good one to definitely add to your collection and once again this is mossy not bad at all would i repurchase this one probably so yeah probably so like i said it was gifted from my husband he wanted me to review this wine so this review is definitely for him and he'll be tasting it with me here shortly and um yeah i would i would i would buy it i mean like I said again, if I, if maybe, I don't know, maybe I will buy it again, you know, just to have it in my collection. Um, you know, if I have a taste for something like this, that way I can have it because it is, it's not a bad one to have in your collection. So just give it a try. Let me know what you guys think in the bottom, in the comment section. If you've tried it, let me know. Um, would you purchase it? You know, let me know. Uh, would you think about purchasing it? Let me know in the comments. Let's talk about it. And until the next video, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Love y'all. Peace.